right, it's me. And I'm finally back at it with a brand new video for your viewing pleasure. Now, I would like to sincerely apologize for not uploading any new content on this channel in months. Now, you probably thought that this channel was dead and I wasn't doing YouTube anymore. But I am sincerely sorry for making you think that. And that is not the case at all. But one of the reasons why I haven't done a new video in such a long time is because I have a job now. I've had it since the summertime. And since I do have a job, that means that it is my first priority and my main priority. So I haven't really put any of my time and effort into this channel and to upload any new videos. And also, by having a job, that means that I have less time during the week to upload and edit and film new videos for you guys. And now that daylight savings time is here, that means that the sun goes down a lot sooner during the week and during the day, basically. So I haven't had much time during the day to film any videos for you guys. And the second and probably the biggest reason why I haven't filmed and uploaded and edited any new videos for you is simply because I just haven't had the urge, the drive, and the creativity to upload any new videos. Now I know that sounds horrible, but for some reason I just haven't wanted to create any new videos. And I just had no idea what kind of video I wanted to do. But with this new year coming, I'm going to make it one of my resolutions, one of my big goals to create new content for you every month and almost every week on this channel. So I hope you guys are excited for that. Now I wanted to say yes, well address my outfit and yes I am wearing pajamas and I look super comfy cozy but the reason why I'm wearing this outfit is because I'm doing my annual what I got for Christmas video. And I thought since I'm doing this video why not look extra cozy in my Christmas pajamas. Now this outfit comes with matching pants so the top matches the pants and the pajamas are from Victoria's Secret. I don't know if you can buy them anymore but that is where they're from and this cute little like jacket sweater type thing is from I think either Macy's or Dillard's and again I don't know if you can buy this anymore but it is super soft and cozy and I just love wearing it as like almost like a robe almost but yes that is why I'm wearing this outfit because I am going to be doing my annual what I got for Christmas video for you guys. Now I know a lot of other YouTubers do this video and I know they get backlash for doing this video because it can seem like they're bragging, they seem rich, or they seem entitled and they're not grateful. But that is not the case because I am super grateful for everything that I have received. I always get way more than I wanted or even like thought of really. And I'm just so grateful for everything I receive every year for Christmas. And I'm just so happy I can get all these wonderful gifts. And I would not ask for more. And it's already too much, to be honest with you. But yes. So I'm not trying to brag with this video. I'm not trying to sound entitled, rich, or privileged at all. I'm just so super grateful for everything I've received. And I hope that this video gives you ideas of what you may want for Christmas next year. What you may want to get someone for Christmas next year. Or just simply what you might want to get someone for their birthday or Christmas or any holiday that you give gifts to someone. So, if you're excited to see what I receive for Christmas, then stay tuned for the rest of this video. And without further ado, let's just get right on into the video. So the first few items that I'm going to be sharing with you that I received for Christmas are all of the clothing items that I received. And the first clothing item that I received, and this is in no particular order, is I got two pairs of tights. And tights are perfect for the winter time because they'll keep my legs warm when I'm wearing a dress or a skirt. And I got this purple color, which I think this color is so pretty. And I got this navy blue color, so I can go with almost anything. And these are a size medium. Because if you look at the sizing chart on the back here, it says a size small is for someone whose height is 4'11", 5'4", and weight is 90 to 120 pounds. 
and a medium is for someone with a height of 5'2 to 5'8 with a weight of 115 to 145 pounds. And since I am 5'7, that is why I got the medium because lengthwise I needed it to be longer. But I'm just so excited to wear these tights because they'll keep my legs super warm and they're pretty colors. So I got both of these tights. And then the next clothing piece I received is a winter hat. And this I was so excited to get because it was on my Christmas list. And I put this on my Christmas list because I do, well did, have a hat similar to this with a little bobble on the top. But what was the problem with that hat was it had a hole in the bottom here on the rim. And so it kind of looked weird when I wore it because it had a hole. So I asked for a new one and I got this one and it is from The Loft and I just think it's so cute and I love the little bobble on the top and I love the colors and it can go with pretty much everything. Any outfit I wear, it'll look perfect with. And let's just take a count in this video how many times I say cute or excited because I'll probably say it a lot in this video so I'm going to apologize now. But yeah, so I got this hat and let me put it on to show you what it looks like. It's not going to look the best because my hair is up. But here is what it looks like on. Don't I look super cute? Ready for the winter time. Ready to be all cozy and warm. And I love how it covers my whole ears. Because normally when I get hats like this, they don't really cover all of my ear. But I love how this one does. It'll keep me extra warm. And I just think it's super cute. And I think I look like a snow bunny with it on if I do say so myself. But yes, that is what this hat looks like on, and I just think it is super cute. And it is from The Loft if you'd like to purchase it. Oh, and I will say all of the items I will be showing you guys, I'll have to try to link in my description box down below. You guys can go check it out and purchase them or just look at them if you want. But yeah, so here's the winter hat I received. Now the next clothing piece I received is this gray dress here. Um, let me just one second. Okay, this gray dress here, and what I really like about this dress is one, the neckline. It's almost like a mock turtleneck, and I just think that's super unique. And I love the color. It's this gray color, so it'll go with pretty much anything. And it is just so soft. I just can't believe how soft it is, and it'll be super comfortable. And I think it's like a swing dress style. I'm not exactly positive about that. But yes, I just think it is super cute, super cozy, perfect for the winter time, so soft. And it'll look super cute and be perfect for, to wear to work. So yes, I got this dress here. And I did ask for dresses I could wear to work on my um, Christmas wish list because I really don't have many dresses I can wear in the winter time because most of them are summertime dresses. So that's why I asked for more dresses that I could wear to work because I do like to dress a little bit up for work and I don't have to. So I was so excited to receive this dress. Now the next clothing piece I received is this sweater here. And I just think this sweater is so comfortable. The material is just so soft. And I love how on the side here, if you can see that, it has these buttons. So I think that adds a little extra to the sweater. And I love the colors, a neutral color. So I can wear this with any pants color I want, any skirt color I want, pretty much anything. And it's a kind of a thick material. So it'll keep me super warm in the winter time. And I just think this is so cute. And this is a size small. And it is from The Loft. So that is what this looks like in a size small. It'll be linked in my description box down below so you can go check it out and purchase it for yourself. Oh, and the dress I just showed you, the gray dress, is from the loft as well. And it is a size extra small. So this is what the extra small dress looks like if you want to purchase it. But yes, so that is the dress and the sweater. Next, I received a matching set. I'm getting right now. Alrighty, so I received a matching set. Here is what the sweater looks like. And I think it is so pretty. I love the fabric. And I like how it's three quarter length. So I can wear this even if it's not super cold out. I can still wear this and not be super hot. But it is of a thicker material. So it will keep me super 
warm when it is freezing cold out. And what I really like about this sweater is the um, collar is almost like a turtleneck, but it's not like super high up. And I want to like fold it over. So I think that is super unique. And I love the um, style of it, I guess you would say. How it's like this boxier style. So it'll look a little bigger on me, which means it'll be super cozy and comfortable. So that is what the sweater looks like. Super comfortable, cozy, and super warm. And then I received a matching skirt to go along with the sweater. And again, I love the material because it is super soft, super cozy, and it's of a thicker material, so it'll keep me super warm in the winter time, even though it is a skirt. And I love how it has the ties on it. They add a little extra to the skirt. And it has pockets, workable pockets, not those fake pockets you see on some items. So I can put things in these pockets. And I just think it is super cute. And both the skirt and the Wait one second. And the sweater here are from the loft. And the sweater is a size extra small. And the skirt is a extra small. So both of these are extra small. They're both super cute, super cozy, super warm, and I just love them. And the reason why I get a small and an extra small or a zero at the loft is because their clothing is tailored more towards older people and so that means their sizing is a lot bigger than what I would wear so I have to get the smallest size but I can still buy their clothing them. I just have to get the smallest size. And then the next two-piece outfit that I received which I'm not actually sure if it's a two-piece outfit but my mother got it for me as a two-piece outfit and that is First off, this sweater here, let me just get it for you, is this so adorable pink sweater. And as you know from looking at my walls, pink is my favorite color. So I was so excited to receive this sweater. And again, it is a super soft material and it's of a thicker material so it'll keep me super warm in the winter time. And I think this is a cashmere material if I can correct. Doesn't say, but yes, this is just so super soft, cute, and just overall perfect for the winter time. And then I got a skirt to go with it. Oh, and this sweater here is from the loft, and it is an extra small. And then I got a matching skirt to go with it, as you can see here. And this I thought was so adorable. I love the pattern, and I love how it has this navy blue, the red, and the pink in it. And I like how it has these two gold buttons on it. They add a little extra to the outfit. One thing I don't like is that the pockets are fake. But that's okay. I don't really need them. And it has this zipper on the side here for easy on and off access. And I just love it so much. And I think it will be a super cute effort to wear in the winter time. And I think it will look super cute with my black booties and boots. Well, taller boots. So yes, and this is a sign zero. And that is what this matching set looks like. I think it is super cute and just screams Vicky because it is my favorite color, pink. Let me put that down. And then the last clothing piece that I received, which I don't really know if it's a clothing item, but I'm considering it one because I do wear it, and that is I received this adorable apron. And I can wear this when I'm cooking or baking because for those of you that don't know, I love to cook and bake. So I can wear this when I'm cooking and baking and I get my outfit all messed up. And I just think this is adorable. I love the pattern, love the collar, and I think it's just perfect for me. And it has two pockets on the side so I can put things in it so it is functional. And I just love it. And this is from Anthropology, and my sister got it for me and I just think it's perfect. So I'll have all of my clothing items linked down below for you. So you guys can go check them out and purchase them for yourself or for someone you know that would love them. So that is all of the clothing pieces I received for Christmas. Now I'm going to share with you all the non-clothing pieces that I received for Christmas. And I'm going to save my most expensive item that I got for Christmas for last. Because it is my favorite Christmas item. And it is the most expensive. So I thought, why not save it for last? So the first 
two items I received that are non-clothing items are I got shampoo and conditioner. Now this brand is the Pureology Serious Color Hair Hydrate and what it does is quench and cleanse hair with hydrate shampoo. Concentrated zero sulfate formula features the exclusive anti-fade complex. So that is what the shampoo and conditioner is for and it is sulfate free and the reason why I got shampoo and conditioner for Christmas is because I currently didn't have any shampoo and conditioner of my own. I was using my mother's and the reason why I was using my mother's shampoo and conditioner is because the last time I went to the hairdresser and got my hair done, I got a keratin treatment done to my hair. So that makes that helps my hair not be so frizzy. And so my hairdresser said I needed to get shampoo that was sulfate free because I got the keratin treatment. And so for the longest time, I didn't have any shampoo and conditioner that was sulfate free. I just had to use my mother's because hers is sulfate free. So for Christmas, she got me some shampoo and conditioner of my own so I don't have to use hers. And this shampoo and conditioner you can get at Ulta. I saw it on there and you can get it at just a hairdresser place, I guess. I'm not really sure if you can every hairdresser place, but I know you can get it at the one I go to. But I know you can definitely get this brand at Ulta. Not sure about Sephora, but I definitely know Ulta. So if you did get a keratin treatment done to your hair and you need a shampoo and conditioner that's not going to have sulfate in it, then I recommend this brand because it smells really good and it keeps the scent in my hair for quite some time. So that is the shampoo and conditioner I received. And then the next item I received is I got a water bottle. Now this is a metal water bottle and the one I currently use, which I needed to get rid of because it leaked and it was just super dirty and hard to clean. So as for new one, and this one is metal as opposed to my other one that was plastic. And this one is Hydro Peak Classics Flow, 32 ounces stainless steel insulated bottle. And it keeps the liquid cold for 24 hours and it's leak proof and has a straw. It's sweat free. 18 by 8 stainless steel, BP free, no toxins, leak proof, double walled insulated, copper coated insulation, but you cannot use hot beverages for this bottle. And I just love this water bottle because again, it is pink. And as you can see, again, from my wall, I love the color pink, favorite color. And I like how this one is metal as opposed to plastic, so I think it'll be more sturdy. And I really love how it's leak proof because my other one was not so leak proof. So I'm so excited to start using this because I have started, well I've been doing it for ever since I started college, but I've been using a water bottle instead of just using like a cup or a water bottle, like a plastic water bottle you just throw away. Because for one, it's just easier that way because I can just fill this up and reuse it. And it helps cut down on the amount of plastic that I'm using and it helps save the planet. So I am so excited to start using this. And again, it is the Hydro Peak water bottle. My mother got it from TJ Maxx. You can probably find it on like Amazon or anywhere online. I'll try to link it down below for you, but yes. Oh, another thing I really like about this water bottle is the um, top here has this little like, um, I guess um, like straw type um, contraption added to it so that I can drink out of it because I'm not a big fan of the water bottles you screw out the top and drink. I like these type a lot better. So I'm so excited to start using that and I'll be using it every day. Now the next item I received is I got this hard drive, external hard drive. Now the reason why I asked for this for Christmas is because since I now have a job I might be doing more filming, more video filming, and so I thought I would get a external hard drive so that I don't take up all that space on my computer and I can put all my videos on this instead. And this is the My Passport 
hard drive. It is a 4 terabyte. And it is specifically for a Mac computer, which I do have, which is why I got this one here. It's time machine ready. And what does it say? Um, easy to use, password protected storage to help you secure your content. Um, it's the, it comes with the portable hard drive, uh, 2x speed USB cables, WD discovery software for WD security and WD Drive Utilities, and it has a quick install guide. So I am so excited to start using this because it will really help with clearing up all the storage on my computer and I know it will be something very useful that I will use pretty much all the time. Now the next item I received that isn't a clothing piece is, and I get this every year, just a different version, I got these books here. This book series is the Crazy Rich Asian book series. And I've been wanting to get this series for so long. Every time I went to Barnes & Noble, they never had the first book to the series. They always had the second and the third. And since I've never read the first book before I just saw the movie, I was like, I can't just buy the second and the third without the first. That doesn't make any sense. So I asked for this for Christmas and I actually got the series so I'm so excited to start reading it because I love the movie and can't wait for the sequel if they do come out with a sequel which I don't know why they wouldn't. But yes, I'm just so excited to start reading this and if you haven't read it before I highly recommend and if you haven't seen the movie before I highly recommend you see the movie. So I got this book series, so excited and it'll be perfect for the summertime when I go on vacation and just perfect for all year round. Now, the last item I received for Christmas was my favorite Christmas item to receive. And I just can't believe I got this item because I've been asking for it for such a long time. And I finally received it and I was so surprised because I didn't put it on my Christmas wish list because it's way too expensive and I just thought I would never receive it. And that item is... I received a new cell phone and I was just so shocked when I received this item I almost cried I was so happy now the phone I have now is the Samsung Galaxy S7 as you can see here you see it in all my videos and this is the Samsung Galaxy S10 so that means I was three generations behind on the Samsung Galaxy phones now you're probably wondering why did I get a Samsung Galaxy phone as opposed to the iPhone? Well, mainly because I've always wanted and had the Samsung Galaxy phones, so I'm just so used to these kind of phones, so I thought I would just stick with it. And I don't really like the Apple phones. I'm not totally against them and think they're bad phones. It's just I like the Samsung Galaxy better. And one of the things I really like about the Samsung Galaxy phones is you don't have to buy an extra um, thing to connect your phone to like different cable. That is why I really like the Samsung Galaxy phones and it's a lot less expensive than the new iPhone. Because I watched a video earlier and I learned that the new iPhone is almost a thousand dollars. That's just so crazy to think about. But the Samsung Galaxy phone is like 800 and something dollars. So that's like dramatically way less expensive. And so I was so excited to receive it. I got the S10 that is the newest Samsung Galaxy model. And let me show you what it comes with. Open it up. So it comes with this little gadget right here, which I'm not really sure what it's for. But it says on the baggie that it is a US, uh, read it. It's a Samsung USB connector. So I guess it's like connected to like different devices. And then it came with this right here so you can plug it into the wall and charge your phone. It came with the charging cable here. And it came with its own set of headphones. And I always love the headphones that the Samsung Galaxy phones come with because they're really good quality and they last for a very long time. Let me put all this back in the bag and I haven't activated my phone yet 
because I thought I had work today, but I didn't. And since I thought I had work today, I didn't want to activate the phone before I had to go to work or like during the week when I have work because what if I can't use my phone for a while? Because I was told once I activate the new phone, I can't use my old phone. So I wanted to wait till the weekend to activate it. And then, oh, it also came with, obviously, the instruction manual. And it came with this gray pick here, as you can see. And you're supposed to use it to be able to take out the memory card or SD card in the phone. Now let me put this bag. Oh, I have to show you the phone. I haven't even showed you what it looks like. Let me go get it. I'm charging it right now. Because, Jesus. Because since it is brand new, I um, have to charge it because it's not fully charged. And per the instruction manual, it says charge it before trying to activate it. So it has a full charge. So let me just close up the box. Oh, and I will say this phone works with the charger I have for this one, which is a wireless charger. So you didn't have to buy a whole new wireless charger, which I was so thrilled about. Saved me money. So let me go get the phone for you and I will return. Alrighty, so I have returned. And here is what the phone looks like. Here's the back of the phone. It is this flamingo pink color. And as I keep saying, and as you can tell, pink is my favorite color. So I was so excited to proceed in a pink color. And here is what the front looks like. It's just this huge screen on the front. And what's different about this phone, as opposed to my S7, is it has no button on the bottom. Because if you can tell on this phone, it has a button on the bottom. But this one has no button, it's just a screen. And I did watch a video before, well not before, but yeah, before filming this video, I watched a video about the Samsung Galaxy S10 because I don't know a whole lot about what features it has and what makes it different from this one. But I watched a video to see why this is better than the new iPhone. And the main reason is the price. It's a lot less expensive. And the other reason is the camera is the exact same as the one for the new iPhone, but the design is a lot sleeker. So instead of having on the back those three um, circles for the camera, it just has this big line on the back. And it's the exact same type of camera. And I was told that this camera for this phone is a lot better than the one from the new iPhone. And it has a bigger screen than the new iPhone and it's a lot slimmer than the new iPhone. So that is why this is supposed to be bigger than the new iPhone. Don't know if that's necessarily true and you can disagree with me, by all means disagree with me. Because that person that did the video could be completely wrong. But yes, this is what the new Samsung Galaxy looks like and my new phone looks like. And I'm so excited to start using it. And I already purchased my own new case for this phone. I got it in a clear style so that you can still see the color, but it's sticky fine. Let me put that away. And so that is everything that I received for Christmas. And I'm so grateful I received all the presents that I received. And I'm just so excited that Christmas happened. I got to open presents. And it was just a magical day. So, my dance video I am sharing with you for this video is called, and it's Christmas themed because this is a Christmas themed video. It is called Ariana Grande Last Christmas slash Downy Choreography. And the reason why I chose this dance is because, for one, I thought it was an amazing dance. Two, it is an Ariana Grande song that I'm dancing to. And Ariana Grande is my favorite singer. And three is to one of my favorite Christmas songs, Last Christmas. So if you want to check out this dance and see why I love it, then I'll have it linked in my description box down below. You guys can go check it out. Now my quote for this video is Christmas themed because again, this is a Christmas themed video. And that is, I wish we could put, I wish we could put up some of the Christmas spirit in jars, open a jar of it every year by Harlan Miller. And the reason why I chose this quote is because I love Christmas. Christmas is my favorite holiday. And as I say with Christmas, come joy and cheer and togetherness and love and just all these wonderful feelings. 
So that's why I thought this quilt was perfect because if you have these feelings all year round, then you'll have a better life because you'll be happier and you'll be less grumpy and sad. And so that is why I chose this quilt because I love the feeling of Christmas and I just love to feel it all year round. So if you love this video and love seeing all the gifts that I received for Christmas, and if they gave you ideas of what you might want for Christmas next year, what you may want to get someone for Christmas next year, or just for any gift giving holiday, then don't forget to hit the like button, the thumbs up, if you love this video, and if you love this kind of video, or just want to see more content from me, and are excited for the new year and seeing more content on this channel, then don't forget to hit the subscribe button down below, and I look forward to creating more content for you in 2020, and I hope you guys had a Merry Christmas, wonderful Christmas, and I'm looking forward to 2020.